A lot of us use Chrome. It is the browser of choice for most people out there. So in today's video, let's take a look at a few keyboard shortcuts that should help you get more out of your Chrome on PC. Hey guys, Ash here. You're watching FTJ by C4 Retech and let's get started. FTJ is new and needs your love, so go on, ring that damn bell. Now before we start, I just want to know what's your browser of choice? Chrome, Firefox or Edge? Maybe you're still on Internet Explorer? I don't know, whatever it is, let me know in the comments below. So let's start things off with a very important shortcut that comes in handy for those annoying times when you close a tab by mistake. I mean, we've all been there, right? Now this can be really, really frustrating, but there is a simple shortcut to get you out of this in a pinch. Just press Ctrl Shift and T and you should see a close tab reappear. You could do this multiple times, so even if you've closed two or three multiple tabs, you can always get them back. Now the second shortcut on our list, for those of you who wanna clear your browser history in a jiffy, it can be quite a hassle. You know, going through settings, menus, and finding the clear browsing data options. Instead, you can just press Control shift delete to jump to the clear browsing data option. This makes it much more easier, doesn't it? Moving on, we've got one for those who don't take risks, you know, just go incognito and disappear off the face of the world. Instead of clicking around to open an incognito tab, you can just hit Control shift n and that opens a new window with incognito mode and you can just browse the internet away without the watchful eyes tracking you. You know, remain safe and secure. Now the next one goes out to all those like me who have way too many tabs open and find it hard ma managing them. Now there are a few shortcuts that can help us out. First, Control plus a number from one to nine switches you between those tabs. So Control plus one takes you to the first tab, Control plus three takes you to the third tab and so on. You could also sift through the open tabs by pressing Control and tab. Control Alt tab takes you back a tab. Shortcut number five is for those times Chrome becomes a bit buggy. Generally, this is caused by some background process or the other inside Chrome that's kind of acting up. So to check what's messing with Chrome and eliminate those processes, you can just go to the Chrome Task Manager. So for this, hit Shift and Escape and Chrome Task Manager should show up. From here, you can see what's running inside Chrome, see what's uh, hogging down Chrome and you can clear it up. For number six, we've got something that made using Chrome so much easier for me. It's a simple little shortcut. Just hit Control L to jump to the address bar. You don't need to go click on the address bar, just hitting Control L and it, you know, the cursor just pops up there. It seems very trivial, but then at the end of the day, you don't have to reach for your mouse as often. I can just keep my hands on the keyboard and I find it kind of convenient from time to time. So moving on, the next shortcut, again, it's got something to do with the address bar. In your address bar, you can just type the name of the website, say Facebook and press Control plus enter. This will add the www and the .com automatically and load up the web page. Pretty neat, right? So number eight, now this has something to do with bookmarks. So you know how you can bookmark pages in Chrome by pressing that star icon that's on the address bar? Well, you don't need to do that. You can just hit Control D and you know save the page as a bookmark. Now before we move to the last one on our list, we have one more for bookmarks. If you wanna manage your bookmarks, you can just hit Control Shift and O, and that will open up the bookmark manager in a new tab. From here, you can manage your bookmarks, create a bookmark folder and organize it. You know, basically get those bookmarks nice and organized. So for the last one on the list, we have a nice little shortcut for those of you who don't use Google to search stuff. If you wanna search something from another search engine uh, directly from your address bar, you can just type the site down and then hit tab and directly type in the search term and search from there. For example, if you type bang.com, hit tab, then type in what you wanna search for, this eliminates a step by not having to go to Bing's homepage. So that's about it for this video. How many of these shortcuts did you know before watching this video? Did you find any of them useful? Let me know in the comments below. BT Dub, would you want me to do a follow-up video with 10 more or maybe do some text for Windows or something? You know, you know, it's early days for FTJ, so do let me know what kind of videos you'd wanna see in the comments below, and I will try to get that done. So if you've not checked out either of these videos, do so, I'm sure you'd find them interesting. Like, subscribe, bell icon, you know what to do. This is Ash, you've been watching FTJ by C4 Retech, and I'll catch you in the next one. Ciao.